uh, dark web forum post here summarized. So I'm going to show you kind of this is the content of the dark web forum post. Now, going through this, especially using something like Google Translate, could take an enormous amount of time. You have Russian, you have some random technical data, and then you it, there's also it's a very, very jargon heavy post if you were to actually translate it. So what we've done here is we're able to use our AI assist to go over and get a really quick snapshot. This post shares information about various US banks and their processing method. ACH is preferred method in all banks and Zelle is also used by most of the banks mentioned. So it provides this really high level kind of overview of what's happening, why it's risky and why it's important. What is the difference between using Google Translate and Flares tool? So Flares tool is doing two things differently than Google Translate. First of all, we found that large language models have a much, much better ability to contextualize information and to translate things accurately and say Google Translate. And then the second piece is we're also trying to go that extra step and summarize things and tell you why they're important as opposed to just pointing out uh, or as opposed to just translating things.